Welcome to Exam Prep Vocabulary Series, where we go through the high-frequency words for standardized tests and competitive exams. This is word list A1. I will walk you through the words, their pronunciation with syllable stress, a couple of examples for each word, synonyms and antonyms where applicable. Abash. The stress is on the second syllable. Abash. It means to make another feel ashamed, embarrassed, or humiliated. It means to cause someone to lose composure. In some colleges, senior students abash juniors in the name of bragging. It has become common for many people to abash those who are obese. Synonyms are embarrass, disconcert. Antonyms are cheer, boy, rally. Abate. Stress is on the second syllable. Abate. It means to make or become less in degree, intensity, value or amount. It also means to lessen or weaken another thing. NASA announced that it would delay the launch of the manned spacecraft until the radiation from the solar flares abated. She hoped that her son's fear of darkness will abate with time. To abate means to become lesser in degree. We waited for the storm to abate before we headed out. Synonyms are ebb, diminish, reduce, subside. Abdicate, abdicate. The stress is in the first syllable. To abdicate is to formally give up a position, a right or responsibility. Commonly, it refers to royalty giving up their throne. King Edward VIII abdicated the throne rather than give up the woman he loved. Elizabeth II of England would probably not have become queen if her uncle, King Edward VIII, had not abdicated. The appeals judge has abdicated his responsibility to review the findings of the High Court. Synonyms, relinquish, renounce, resign, give up. Antonyms, occupy, retain, maintain. Aberrant, aberrant. The stress is on the second syllable. Aberrant means a deviation from what is normal, what is desirable or expected. It's a deviation from what is customary and what is a natural course of action. Something that is aberrant is strange. For centuries, solar eclipses were regarded as serious aberrations in the natural order. The teen's aberrant behavior made his family suspect that he was using drugs. Normally a calm and steady worker, Jim's argument with his colleague has been noted to be aberrant. Synonyms are abnormal, atypical, deviant, unusual. A bet. The stress is on the second syllable. A bet. To a bet is to assist someone in an activity that is probably illegal. To encourage or assist someone with a plan or activity, like in case of an accomplice to a robbery. A bet comes from an old French word, abateur, meaning to bait. You often hear the phrase aid and abet on crime shows like Law and Order. 
The driver of the getaway car was charged with aiding and abetting the robber. The country abets terrorism by supplying arms and explosives to rebels. Advanced education, high intelligence and good mental health abet empathic accuracy. Synonyms are aid, support, encourage. Abeyance. The stress is on the second syllable. Abeyance. Abeyance is a temporary suspension or suppression. If you set aside something temporarily, it is abeyance. This word is used to indicate a break or a gap in an activity. A good judge must hold his or her judgment in abeyance until all the facts in a case have been presented. We kept our travel plans in abeyance until we were certain that we had enough money for the trip. Construction of the highway is in abeyance until we get agency approval. Synonyms are hiatus, inactivity, recess, suspension, dormant. Abhor. Abhor. The stress is on the second syllable. To abhor means to hate, detest, to find something or someone loathsome, contemptible, or repulsive. Because he always ended up getting hurt when he tried to play soccer, Sam began to abhor the sport. I abhor the smell of burning tires. Synonyms are loathe, despise. Antonyms love, abide. Abide. The stress is on the second syllable. Abide. Abide means to bear or accept a person or condition. It is to patiently wait or tolerate. Though he did not agree with the decision, Chuck decided to abide by it. If there is one thing I cannot abide, it is a lack of discipline. If you abide by a law, agreement or decision, you do what it says, even though you do not want to do. Abide also means to live in a place or to reside in a place. For example, he abided in the wilderness for 40 days. Synonyms are tolerate, endure, withstand, persevere. Abject. Stress is on the first syllable. Abject means completely hopeless, miserable, pitiful, very bad, something that allows no hope of improvement or relief. If you're in a state of complete hopelessness, destitution or resignation, you use the adjective abject. It describes the most miserable kind of situation. They lost everything when their house burned down and have since lived in abject conditions, often homeless. After losing her job, falling into a puddle and breaking her ankle, Alois spent the day in abject misery. In many countries, abject poverty is often found side by side with luxury hotels and resorts. Synonyms are downtrodden, miserable, wretched. Abjure. Stress is in the second syllable. Abjure. To abjure is to give up one's previously held beliefs or habits. Often under oath, when you solemnly swear that you give up or reject something, you abjure.
The reformed socialite abjured her former lifestyle and all those with whom she had previously associated. Seal had to abjure all indulgence when he entered the training camp. Since enrolling in the diet program, she has abjured sugar and saturated fats. Synonyms Forswear, renounce, recant, repudiate.